ever to conquer. Never to you. For Independence High School, this. 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 This is Heim. This is Night News. Good morning, Nights. It's Wednesday, October 4th, and I'm Addison Williams here with your IHS update. With a decade of IHS traditions, Night News' V. Sevilla takes a look at what makes homecoming possible every year. With homecoming only days away, IHS is celebrating its 10th year of HOKO traditions. Student Council President Anya Chidananda says Stuco plans to make this year's homecoming one of a kind. It's our 10 year anniversary and it's great that Bejeweled is our theme because it is like purple, sparkles, jewels, and it basically shows the best way that independence shines because it's our school colors and 10 year anniversaries. Homecoming brings together students from every school program, each representing their school spirit. We have homecoming posters along the window arches that each club, each curricular club, um, they get the opportunity to make a poster and it usually like aligns with their theme. Chidananda speaks on what homecoming means to IHS and the student body. All of us students, we work hard every day and school can be tiring sometimes. And homecoming is just a great way to celebrate everything that we do every day here at Independence. From pep rallies to posters, IHS Cheer plays an integral part in the makings of homecoming. Cheer captain Samantha Tenbrink speaks on how cheer lets their school spirit shine. The week before homecoming, cheer stays after school one day and decorates the entire foyer. It takes a lot of time, but putting our minds together and making really creative ways to make the school really pretty for everybody is actually really fun. The time and dedication cheer spends on practices uplifts the student body. Practices get pretty intense. Um, we practice after school, especially this week, just to try to perfect that routine. And we also do a thunderstruck performance, which gets the crowd really hyped and just ready for the weekend. For years, staff and students alike have worked together to make homecoming happen. Assistant Principal Frank Weiss speaks on the preparation it takes for this major event. There's a lot of time and a lot of heads involved, a lot of people communicating. We coordinate with Stuco. Um, we coordinate with our cheer. So there's a lot of little things that um, add up in time and add up in energies, but we've got a lot of great people here to make it work. Weiss talks about what Heim truly means to him. The big thing is um, independence really is a place that people do call home. We have so much overlay and students do so many things together on our campus um, and we collaborate so well together that I really think that Heim is more of a, a feeling when you walk through these halls because everybody feels incorporated into Independence High School. For Night News, I'm V. Sevilla. October is Cybersecurity Awareness Month. Today's tip is don't click on pop-ups that tell you your computer is infected with a virus. It often downloads malware or viruses. Instead, open up your virus scanning sophomore and run an independent scan instead. Varsity football takes on Creekview High School tomorrow at 7 o'clock. The game is at Toyota Stadium. Make sure to wear your mums, garters, and hoko shirts. IHS Volleyball faces off against the Warriors tomorrow here at Heim. JV and freshmen start at 6.30, varsity at 5.30. AP exam payment is now open until November 1st. Payment can be made through online school fees. Register before November 1st to avoid late fees. Knights, don't forget that this weekend is a four-day weekend. There is no school on Friday, October 6th, and Monday, October 9th. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one indivisible. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Thanks for watching Nights. Be sure to check us out on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram at IHS Night News to stay up to date with all things independent. You can also check out our online newspaper at IHSNightNews.org. Have a great day and we'll see you next time.